Listen, man, I need to see this right here. Yes, sir, man. I've been seeing a whole bunch of visit. And I know that this would have popped up on. What is it? Grilling. About to be hilarious. So listen, man. Like, subscribe. Share the video. I'll on TikTok. Twitch. Reddit. We did a song versus. Definitely go check that out. That's gonna drop very yeah. soon on this channel. So I gonna see that. Just uh, social media on the screen. So listen, man. And, and, uh. My name is Dale Elias, and I am here because I am actually the grill master, and this is grilling. I can give the grilling. I don't think I would handle it. That in in Jamaican terms, that just don't sound right. Honestly, you're not going to grill me. Um, that's no anything happen happen. So if it if it if it work out, it work out. If it don't work out, I'm perfectly fine. I'm born ready. We're ready from like yesterday. I'm <laughs> ready tomorrow. <laughs> Whenever you're ready, be ready. Hello. Uh, one. You okay? Yes. You all right? Yeah, thank you. What's your name? Dale. Dale? Mm-hmm. Why she fake that? Oh, you're from Jamaica? Yeah. Do you still live there? No, I live in California now. Oh, nice. He's got a beautiful smile. He's got really nice teeth. Um, yeah, he seems really sweet. I like him. So you came all the way from California today? Yeah. It's a lot of traveling for me. Right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yo, that girl is pretty. Is that why you were late today? This is uh, traffic yeah. in London. Hmm. Um, not used to it? No, not at all. We make a wrong turn. I'm not angry, but I will let him give him a chance to still win me over. What's the traffic in California like? Probably worse. OK, so you should probably be used to it then, No, hey? but the road's smaller. Because the road's smaller, when we miss a turn, we keep on spinning in circles. OK. Yeah, man, so should I should try grill me now, but I mean, do the grilling, you know? I'm mean, actually the original grill master. Are you serious? Yeah. By the way, what's your name? Michelle. Hi, Michelle. Stop what do you do? Me. I am comedian and actor. Oh, lovely. Yes. Oh, he's an actor. That's cool. In what films have you been in? I've been in Sprinter. It's a track and field movie. Were you the main actor? Yes, I was. Oh, you were? Yes. Really? Might watch that later. So do you go on a lot of dates? No, not necessarily. Do you enjoy the women more in London? I haven't really seen a lot of the women in London, but you know, I see you. But yeah. We're doing it great for the London girls. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You do a good job. <laughs> you know, Minago, Minago. You know, but yeah, you do a very good job. Thank you. Quite smooth. Yes, I. Mm -hmm. Your mom <laughs> like me, you know. Your mom didn't call it veg or something, but she liked me. <coughs> <coughs> she liked me. So. Was it like um, in Jamaica? Was it dating pool like that? Um, the women are good. The women are all good looking, you know. Jamaican women, I still yeah, think are Jamaica, the best. Women. Okay, Jamaica's the type. Yeah. That's nice. Yeah, but I know I like all me. women. I'm a Jamaican. I'm a Jamaican man, so all women are going to work out for me. <laughs> <laughs> not very picky then? No, not necessarily. What's your like, ideal type? You. I'm not Jamaican. You. Mom say me like all women. No, so yeah. Type. Yes, you look. You look very nice. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he likes me. What do you look for in a man? Confidence. She says about every nigga yeah, that like... Nice smile. Me that. Yeah. <laughs> Lux. <laughs> Yeah, love, love them. I actually do love them. Thanks. Why do you think we hate? Yeah, man, I feel like she genuinely does see me sit down and she has a no, man, this is the man we want. You know what I mean? I can't wait. We can make some like nice little Sparta kids, you know, they look like British. Why should she turn strong, left? You know, send the raven type of like warrior. <laughs> Yo. You have really nice teeth too. Good, because enough people here in a brush them teeth, I like how your teeth just white. <laughs> I don't know if it's a London thing. I've seen a lot of yellow teeth since I've been there. Really? Some of them teeth that look like them can just like drop out. Like, <laughs> Yo, <laughs> no, why is he giving niggas 50? <laughs> ain't no way, bro. I see myself in the teeth right now. I forgot what I was saying. <laughs> I really like him so far. Oh, yeah, confidence, great smile, great eyes, yeah. um, assertiveness, dominance. Yes. Yeah. Smart. Yes. And hold a great conversation. Mm -hmm. Family man. Are you university educated? No. Are you? So you want a smart man. Oh, uh, he doesn't have to be university <laughs> oh, but just like smart. No, just, uh, just not fair. Street smart. Street smart. All right. mm. Wise. Mm. Not smart. Wise. Wise. Yeah, yeah I like, like that. Like a wise man. Mm -hmm. Without a doubt, I like her. You know, she look good. Um, I like how she speak. She look like she has proper etiquette. You know, she, she could have get it. She could have get it. She was ready for the cutting board. Literally. I love his accent. I could listen to him talk all day. You want to live in the States? Yeah, LA. I love it, yes. Um, I actually know an immigration lawyer. Nigga, like LA so much. Right away. I don't, I, yeah, I don't. Yeah. I don't know. Oh, I know he'd be out there getting crafty, though. 
in Jamaica, that's what we call it. Sort out. I'm what sorting you, you out. I'm getting you your papers. Do you think you're ready to get married? Absolutely not. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> She's just selling me a dream. I'm Jamaican. <laughs> Nah, what does that mean, bro? He's wildin'. There is no doubt in my mind that this girl is like She like me. Me, I tell you that. Remember. <laughs> What's your biggest deal breaker in a woman? Lazy. Hmm. Food I have to cook, clothes I have to wash, house I have to clean, and she have to have ambition. I really believe um, that uh, a woman is supposed to make a man better. Yeah, 100%. I believe a woman should be my piece. You know, like nagging. Nagging, I don't know if you understand what that means, but yeah, yeah, me can't deal with it. Yo, me just love the fact that she can't understand the language. I actually am enjoying this conversation. Can you cook? Yeah. Good, what can you cook? Everything. What is everything? I can cook Jamaican food really great. A girl is a liar. That girl is a liar. 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 I know you're going to say something else, but guess what? I know how to cook and I know how to clean. Mm -hmm. Very good. Do you also know how to be at peace? Yes, I love peace. Oh, that was quite cute. What if you got like five girlfriends? This is why I don't have multiple relationships. When you are around one, the other might be sending a message, might send you a message and turn off and affect the relationship that you have with that one. So when a bunch of women fighting for your attention to me, that's kind of confusing. And I don't necessarily want to go down that road. So that me not understand why she asked me about other women when me and her sit down. Do you think you'd like to get married? <laughs> yes, I do. When me and her Um, Do I believe in monogamy? Let me answer this the best way possible. Oh, I believe monogamy. Hi is right and i think it's the perfect situation in which to raise a family i really believe i have to get to that stage okay do i think i am as disciplined enough to be monogamous right now <laughs> monogamous not a bomb of that. <laughs> well i know you <laughs> sure thank you from me and marie now i probably shouldn't say that enough he is never going to be in a monogamous relationship but guess what i will get there Oh, wait. You know, it take me, it take me time, you know. Yeah, I thought, well, you're not going to miss the lesson, you're not going to marry you. Let me just meet you. You just asked me to marry about 10 minutes ago. I don't remember that. I'm a Jamaican. <laughs> <laughs> no, you play well. This guy's all over me. Do you think men should provide in a relationship? Absolutely. Do you think you'd be able to provide for me if we were together? Yes. In every way? Financially, sure. Mm -hmm. Sexually, sure. There were, but there's levels to where me sexually can provide for you, though. Me, me, me not provide like all the money up here, I do. Yo, nah, he is. He's about to. Yo, you about the black one? Yo, nah, you really know what he's about to say, bro. Let's see. Me, me not provide like all the money up here, I do. Yeah, me, me can't provide like that. Yeah. Can provide your wood and steel. Yo, <laughs> still? <laughs> nah, he's going crazy. Nah, nah what is still got it? <laughs> oh, sh oh shit, good. Lean back real quick. Want some fat Joe shit? Tight shit. understand that oh, foreign okay. people feel yeah. like say, we must just come and just do what we do. Because some of them talk about this is Saddam and Gomorrah. Right? Me not nah, do that. Me never mm. grew up like that. I wasn't cultured like that. Just like how some of them brush my teeth up here and they repeat them right now. Me not cultured. Me not pum pum. That's just not my thing. Me not there yet. Maybe me can't get there, but me not get there yet. God, he's terrified of this. Why? Because me not do it. Me not answer that. Me not answer that. Ever. I am not going to say ever as a Jamaica. Sorry. Sorry, Jamaica. I'm not going to say ever. The reason why I'm not going to say ever is because at each point in your life you realize that you were you were doing so you, your beliefs change after a period of time. Yeah. That belief of mine has not changed as yet. Okay. I don't know when it is going to change. You never know. My wife. Yeah. Probably. I get born out for this now. We can't cut this. I get born out for this. You know what I love? What? 
I love that you can understand me. You talk English. But I have to like fix it up. Right? Yeah. You talk man, English. Not the American people you know, understand. Really? Yeah. But to be honest, I think if you're not familiar with a Jamaican accent, mm -hmm. it's completely unfamiliar territory. Like it'd be, it'd be like an alien language. Yeah, but, but you yeah. like it. I do like it. You can see it. You know, I mean, he's be speaking Pato, and you think that he's speaking like nah, but see, see him I can understand though, like perfectly, like There's the real whole like the older Jamaican. heads be wowing, like that's a whole different like. That's if you hear like my my grandpa talk, you know what like, I'm saying? Uncle, like yeah, you definitely not gonna understand. Man. Yeah, that's like a whole like another dialect music, type shit. It's just a stronger accent. Is, um, making my way downtown. Yeah, yeah, the way I play that, you know me. I, mean? I was not expecting that. That's something nice. I like certain white music of a buzz. Well, what other white music do you like? Um, me used to listen to like some old Taylor Swift. You listen to Taylor Swift? Yeah, man. Would you date Taylor Swift? No. No. Taylor Swift wants some meat for our body. Okay, you know what? Yeah, yo. Passionate about this, isn't he? Yeah, me have to, me have to hold on for something. When me asleep, something have to cushion. Right. <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy because he's dead ass right now. He's not playing. <laughs> nah, I feel him. Nah, that's what I'm saying. That, that nah, that happened. Yeah, as a slim nigga, it's like, come on I'm now. I'm like a fit woman. Do you exercise? Yeah. Great. I like that you exercise. You take care of your I body. I do Pilates too. See, the thing is, I can't really pronounce that, and I have to slow that down for me now. Pilates. Oh, what? Pilates. Pilates? Yeah. Pilates? Pilates, yeah. Wait, Niam? Pilates. All my life. Pilate. Wait, Pilate. Pilate. Pilate, now. Why did he say it like that? Yeah, he said a good verse, though. I never, never like do Pilates before. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yoga. Come on. Wait, you see, see, I think we're idiots. Oh. What is he on about? It's just the accent. Pilates. But it's, it's Pilates, yeah. Pilates sound rich. You have money? Pilates. <laughs> Pilates sound like a bad word, you know. Hey boy, Pilates! <laughs> <laughs> sure. Yeah. Yeah. Pilates just sound rich. You know, have the money to do that. Yeah. <laughs> do you think you're quite outside on Instagram? Are you in girls' DMs? Do you DM a lot? No, not necessarily. No? No. You really like that term, not necessarily, don't you? Yeah, because I don't know, I feel like it's the first big word I learn. Oh. I'm just work with it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> He's definitely in everyone's DMs. If I had seen you on the street walking, without this camera or nothing, I would stop my car and run you down. Baby, <laughs> what go on? What your name? Yeah. Your name, baby. Give me a hand. Yeah. We're together now. Somebody <laughs> me think. He is so funny. Like, in person. Conversation. So, but if you saw me online, or anyone you saw online, and you wanted to reach out, and it was probably someone you wouldn't cross paths with, yeah. would you slide in at the end? Mm, boy, you yeah, have to look really good for getting me to do really? that. That's impressive. Say. So? I love attached men. I want somebody who always want to be in my presence when I'm in a baby. Watch and know. All right, I have her, you know. I have her, the female sister, I have her. I'm mine. I'm mine. Me, I left her with her. Put it. What if she's like always wants to be around you? If she's there on me every day, that me and my broke. And she broke. Yeah, but if you're provided for her, then she could just come to work with you. What the bomb buckle at? No. <coughs> actually, <coughs> what? Work and home is different. Okay, so the you just want her to be constantly in your presence. What if she's like ringing you all day, texting you all day? She, she can't ring my phone all day. Yeah. That don't mean I got an answer. No, yeah. That don't mean I got an answer. If me have something to do, she must understand, say, that you're busy. busy right now. Yeah. Because what I realized, when you put your career first and your money, until I have a family, money comes first. Mm -hmm. Then relationship, yeah. and then everything else. What about family? The moment I have a family. No, what about the family that you have now? Let me explain something to you about a Jamaican man. You see, as a Jamaican, it's a privilege to live abroad. Mm. So when I live here, you will, you will have to realize that my family get all my money. Every Saturday, every Sunday, I have to, go to the Union. I have to buy my grandmother glasses. I have to fix the roof. 
I have to bury my uncle that died five times now because every week somebody yeah. gets up into the die. Yeah. have a lot of people relying on you. When money is first, everything else kind of helps. Any they man without money is miserable. That's why I got to send barrels and all that. Without money, I can't <laughs> right now, me see. You just have to dig no. Not me. No, it's true. Exactly. Not like, you have to be rich though, but you'd have to have some sort of financial comfortability. Some, some sort of ambition. Yeah. If she spend too much time with you, what are you doing? Yeah, it's true. And if she have too much time, what she had to True. Exactly. Fetishes, huh? You know, no fetish? No. What do call fetish, though? Like an odd, an odd sexual... I don't even know if I fetish it name, but I have something to do with shame. Well, I'm ashamed of... All right, I have a one fetish. Go on. Okay. Tell me if it's a fetish now. Don't laugh, you know. Okay. What is this fetish going to be? When we start regularly have sex, I realize, I'm a gangster. I realize uh, that one day a girl that kicked my neck and she got down and she like, licked my nipple and I said, BOOM MO CLAD! <laughs> what is this? But you loved it. And I said, all right, yeah, yeah, I'm like too excited. But yeah, me like that. If that's a, if, if I don't that's, think that's a thing. I think most men do. And then I go on like them, then I like, yeah. Then I like go on like them. Like I don't like foot and them things. I see uh, them and they were like foot and all them things. I don't want a foot. You don't want foot in your mouth. Where are the, where your foot are doing in my mouth? This is taking a turn. You don't want it? Because this year, I'm not going to like what I'm going to say put foot in my mouth. So that's a big no. Repent. If you have foot in your mouth, just repent. <coughs> Wash out your mouth and just try to make nobody know so you don't want to do it. They are eating foot. What if I said I really like Where it? foot are doing a mouth? Come, where foot are doing but a mouth? people say it could be pleasurable, so if I said... I don't know that mouth. Yeah, I don't get that. You cut the toenail then? Yeah, I get get the toenail. I have to push my foot in your mouth. Yeah, fuck it. Push it. You know what you're a soft foot? What's that? Some people soft foot are England and a lot of soft... A lot of people do, yeah. Where do you have one? Suck foot are England. You're a soft toe. Not me. Like the toe lotion People or anything like that? No. You know, toe Dry fungus? Dry back foot in your, foot, in your mouth. You know, like toe nails. How many of y'all got foot for the shoes, mom? Yeah, That's a scary... Man, over here, I put foot in a, in a, in a woman's mouth. And woman are like, what them do with that foot? Don't you just put anything in You know what they say? Like, if you really love someone, no part of their body would not go in your mouth. No, me not love hmm. nobody. You know, no. put <laughs> every part of them. Really? <laughs> every Maybe part. What does that even Nah, yeah, what does that even mean? Because that's kind of... <laughs> yeah, you you walk on them Johns, mo. Show some Jeffree Star and shit. What is it? Everybody... <laughs> Yo, what is this? Show some Jeffree Dome and shit. Nah, yeah. Party to party, Fuck man. Fuck out of here. No. No, that is, that is a non-negotiable. The me is not one of them Monday. We are going to come here and go out. No, we're not eating no ass. What about yours? What? The other way around. Where? What? If someone did that to you. <laughs> Where them just, what? See? See? You know what? We're done. We're done. A little more. Keep that I'm out of here. Because what do you mean? That's not going to ever happen. Never. Never in my life. You never allow it. That will never ever happen. You might enjoy it. Yeah, because no. No. So you don't really make somebody eat your ass? No, me, no. Don't bring me into this. I'm just asking you. <laughs> no, that is a non-negotiable. Me against eating ass in every level. That's a void. Never. Even, every listen, time. What if it was your wife here? She's like, look, I really want to try it. If she want to eat my ass, me a divorce her. Really? Yes. Okay. <coughs> no, that is a red flag. Excuse me, a divorce her. She's chatting his filth. If she feel like, say, my she want ass, body. she feel put her How that work? It, yeah. Me need another woman. Okay. And that means she's not, she not clean at all, she's not hygienic at all. That. I shit your shit out of your ass, you know. <laughs> I can't carry on with it. Yeah. You know what I'm trying? Your shit out of your ass. Oh, I know, I don't. I'm speaking to these activities. I can't believe we're still talking about this. No, my concern now. You have any friend out there where I eat ass? Oh, quite possibly, I don't ask them. In, no, any ass eating people in here? Do you think it's worse to have it done to you or to do it? We could stop talking about ass now. We don't talk about ass now, guys, no. We're not Jamaican. We don't talk about ass now. <laughs> Shit. Sure. Sure. No. You got our hearts real quick. No. 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 Why? 
if I am going to be friend with a woman, she's ugly. Me can't be your friend. Why? Can't be that f you. Well, that's a consensual thing. It'd have to be both of us that want to do exactly. that. Exactly. Then if you say no, me, I'm going to vex. And then me go vex. Yeah, I'm going to vex. Really? I've got male friends. I mean, you kept it on it. If me and a girl are friends, honestly, she have to like ugly. She have to, I mean, she have to like so ugly too. Me, I talk about like, like rescue she from like, nah, ugly. Me, I talk about like, from like, different level of ugly. Yeah, if I said to you, like, look, it's crazy. We really watched like the movie night, right? Yeah, yeah, we no. definitely did watch that. Tune yeah, in the movie night, man. We just watched the movie the other day. Kick. Dude, we watched the no, fire I movie. Can't we I, do, man. I would say it and respectfully step away. Okay. Because I, I really don't believe that. If a man is attracted to you, him is attracted to you. Not every man's attracted to every woman. Exactly, but there's, there's always boundaries. So the thing is, say, say the girl look good. Mm. If she look good, but then she eat ass, make can be a friend. But if I find a woman attractive, I know myself, I would rather not be friends with her. Especially if she look good, you know, up with an NEC, a bus in her head, me here, a little white rum, me and her a dance to a couple Jamaican music, you know, all of a sudden, probably all one, one Bob Marley start playing, all of a sudden, it just look nice, she just look nice, you know, some could you be loved type thing, some could you be. Okay, but what if it was like straight from the start? All it takes is for she get up and walk where I miss her ass. <coughs> Something that got happen. Me not trust it, so. Wow. He kept it. Oh, so he said, wow. Have you ever had a proper heartbreak? <sighs> proper heartbreak. Me start get sad already. Oh no. I probably get my heart broken like about two, two times. I would have really counted as heartbreak. Yeah, first time was in the eighth grade. And what about the second time you got your heart Second time you get my heart broken was my fault. You know, me to cheat. <gasps> That's disgusting. So you broke her heart and now you're classing it as no, your heartbreak? No, she broke up with me. My heart broke. You broke up with, you ended the relationship by cheating. No, she ended the relationship by leaving me. But you broke up, you broke her heart. I don't think so. Make it sense. <laughs> well, she would have left you if she wasn't heartbroken. I don't believe that. I believe that. So you're the victim here? I'm, yes, I'm the victim. First, you it, cheated. First, I never start out as the victim, you know. Okay. So this is how it works. So okay. when, the, when a woman just find out you're cheating her, you play it cool. I'm sorry. No, go on your back. Hope you can work it out. If she say no, we move on. Send her a text every day. Hey, how is everything? You try to see her. Don't work. Third time, we message her. We say, so you really, you really done. Fourth time, it's her fault. It's, so because she it's, doesn't it's want to forgive your infidelity, it's her fault. She's at fault that you cheated. No, I mean, I really, I said that, but I just tell her how we do it. How you have to do that? How you have to left me? She cheated on her. Yeah, but, but, uh, why is she so much like <laughs> But, uh, okay. Blaming his ex for leaving him. It's her fault they broke up because he cheated. Yeah, man, because a woman plays victim all the time, you know, so it's good. It's good when a man can play victim and beat them. She never did love you. She never did love you. If she not take you back. Nah, she he's jokes. So if I cheat <coughs> on you, done. Okay, now you left me. Now Quick. that's your fault. How dare you leave me? If you cheat by you, don't. Mm, double standards. She agree with me. Me know she agree with me. If you meet a man and every girl want that man, you're probably going to be attracted to that man. But that doesn't mean that he should be going to every girl that wants him. He's not going to go to everyone that wants him. But he did because I was at that age when I was finding myself. Oh, wow. That one? Yes. Mm. No, listen to me. Everybody has times in their life when they grow up. Do you think you'll ever just admit that it was your fault? And that she's probably the one that was actually more hurt from the whole ordeal than you were? Medieval, medieval, you lose me when you say it's my fault. <laughs> you shouldn't have said that. Lost Lord, me. Sweet. Blame men. For cheating because mm -hmm. they're the ones that cheat yeah and we are the ones that cheat yeah but women need to understand that men don't leave women that doesn't mean that so she if, has the right so has to stay on, because you're cheating never said she has to stay but she never did have to go well she's <laughs> <laughs> no, take a break <laughs> take a break no that was the one time what the fuck is he talking about take a break <laughs> what's your final about what did i cheat hey. on her? a lot you know you still cheated. One time, still one time. It's still, that's enough to end a relationship. Cheating is cheating. Full stop. Would you divorce your husband? Yes. Dumb. Yeah, that not make Dumb. sense. Dumb. You didn't even drink that from the sitting right there, so you just, just divorced. Yeah, done. What? For cheating? Yeah. Yeah, too late. 
me like that. Make sure so you stay upon that, you know, because then everybody have the discipline. They yeah. Keep, I feel keep like that. if we are together and you can disrespect me like that, then there's no love there. No, but there's levels to cheating. I really believe that. I don't think that's true at all. A woman is a man's biggest weakness. Mm -hmm. Woman destroy empires. Man go to war over woman. Yeah, 100%. A woman have no idea how powerful she is. Like, if you are on the right path, the easiest way to get a man off the right path is a woman just come calling. You drive straight and a girl just say, and I say, whoops, it just gone. <laughs> whoops. Yo. Yeah. We just feel like with genetic makeup, we never ever justify cheating. Being a married man and cheating, I think probably that is where we draw the limits in okay. terms of. So you think it's different if you, you say your vows and you get married? Then That's why I'm not married yet, or married because I don't really want to lie in front of God, you know. Do you know what? It's actually really, really wholesome that you take marriage so seriously because that is a lost tradition now. I don't want to like lose my family. When you have something worth keeping as a man, maybe that is when you won't cheat. Won't cheat. But now, resource is different where. Same have an escort. That count? No, that does count. It's still cheating. Yeah, all right. I prefer just hide it. I prefer just hide <laughs> I'm it. I'm do it. Yeah, but I am... Do you know you said like women are men's biggest weakness? Mm -hmm. Would that not mean it would be your biggest strength to overcome any sort of temptation? Mm -hmm. But if Samson... So you'd be like the strongest ma kind of man. Ma'am, ma'am, Samson is the strongest man ever in this world. Yeah. And Delilah get him out. I don't have the strength of Samson. I look like Samson too. No, no, not all. And if Samson can do it, who is me? Be better than Samson. No, I'm not better than Samson. I'm better than Samson. Why? I am just saying that the Western world and society right now set relationships to a standard where not all men can be held to but that standard. But they can if they choose to. Mm -hmm. Also, I think how they're brought up plays a big part in how they become. Yes, because I am going to be very honest with you now. I'll, I'm glad you said that. When I was younger and my friends used to come over, my grandmother used to tell them, come out of my house, bring some girl in my house. Really? I want no ma too much man in my house. Too Take much man. <laughs> and my grandmother used to say hi to every single girl as if she is the only girl I have in the world. Oh my God, I've heard so much about you. And oh wow, she was that. I'll never be that person. Exactly, but never. just imagine how many mothers are like that. Mm. Yes, how oh, many so mothers... So they kind of condone that life path for the, when they get older for them to cheat? Society. Mm. Society can do that. Mm. Out of sight, out of mind. You ever hear that before? When a woman out of your sight, she out of your mind. So just imagine what she had when you now look, because she not trust you. So why you for trust her? And then get a lie to I realize now that a woman is not going to say, you know what, I don't like him. He has a girlfriend. I would say that. To me? Yeah. Maybe not to somebody else. Yeah, I would say to any single person. No, the right, the right man change your mind quick. Lie. You need no. to know where your draw's gone. Your draw's just no. gone. What if he has a girlfriend? I don't need to be number two. And I will never be number two. I will never be a number two in my life. I meant that with my right. soul, with my chest. May God strike me down if I'm lying. I will never do oh, it. Shut up. Men, we are the right. We're trying to get the women and impress them. But the moment you stop focusing on women and focus on career and goals and becoming the best man for a woman. Women come. Yeah. And then come in jobs. Are they the women we... that you want around you though? Are they just women that will have you? Ninety five percent of men got their heart broken by the women that they want. So do you think most men now don't go for women they want, mm. they just go for the safe option? I know men practical. I mm. If you marry the love of your life Kudos to you. The little girl. Kudos to you. What would you do if I couldn't cook? If they couldn't cook? Mm -hmm. Teacher. So it's not a deal breaker? Me, me, I, you, me, I put you up on a rigorous one month cook plan. <coughs> you see like that Dave Ramsey. When name? <coughs> Gordon Ramsey. Dave Ramsey. Dave Ramsey. Dave Ramsey. One of them serious, vigorous. So listen to me. This needs okay, salt, black like pepper, thyme. Peas, may I show you how to cook rice and peas? You get the coconut with the peas, and I tell you how long to cook it, and the axe still, you have to steam it for a certain time, soak it in the fridge overnight. You see, when I teach you that now, and then you can't cook, can't work. 
Me no want no girl. No girl with you. I mean, at least he's giving you a, a, a trial run. He's training you. It's not even like he just expected. Mm -hmm. What? Yeah, I'll let you do I find that cool. Sex in the kitchen, duh. The moment me and her start need the flower, man. Just start lift up the dress. Something, something. <laughs> But definitely, cooking with a woman is fun. I like to. It's nice. It's actually not. Nice. See, the thing is, a man want to teach a woman something, you know. Yeah, they so, feel like fulfilled oh, when they can teach them when you can teach somebody something. Yeah. Yeah. Because me can cook. I love the like, day in the kitchen. Teach our culture too. Because when we have to use it, I feel loud. Cartel of your play. Pastor. Yeah. Work it down in the kitchen. Oh, every every, every song that ever invent needs to be a play. That's why I mean. And I want to know to cook certain type of food. Not only Jamaican food, but a wide variety of food. I love a woman that can cook. What would you do if I didn't shower for two days? So you just don't be it for two days? Oh, no, absolutely not. Yeah, I've just not showered for two days. As a woman? If what? Women stink when they're not be able to. Humans in general would get quite stinky after two days. Because if she's not bearded enough, she probably not brush her teeth. That means her arm probably like her musty. If a woman don't be it, I can't even trust her. Not even for be with her, I wouldn't trust her. <laughs> she walk in the bank and I smell a woman, I don't want her. What if she was like, just working really hard. Error. Nigga, what? Syntax error. Parallax error. That can't work. She worked really hard. Yeah, she's working really hard. You know, say so it take about five minutes to be it. So would that be a break for you if she's not be it? If she's in the shower, yeah. When we had to do it, I wouldn't want to put her in the shower. You put her in the shower. Yeah, what? What if it's a one-off? Mumma, it takes five minutes to be here. If you can't take five minutes, it also be here. <laughs> 24 you hours. Five days you could I take. Bathe. Now, five you days is crazy. What, she's going to smell like Jack Sparrow with what? What, what, what is? You there with a pirate? What she have against water? So what, what she have a problem? Water, does, you just go in the shower, you turn it on, you spin around, you come back out. That not make no sense. <laughs> the Look here. You spread it. Wash her. Mm. If she can't do that, if she can't take five minutes out of her day for do that, what may I do on her? So that's a big thing for your hygiene. If two days pass and a woman a beard, me don't even know if I'm a woman. <laughs> me, me know. Mm -mm. <laughs> Shave? You'd be a scary just ask me if I'm a with a man. <laughs> but what if I went to prison for two years? I'm a witch. Loyal? No, but I'm a witch. When you come out, you're ready again. Would you send me money? Yeah. And, and come and visit me and, and let me call you all the time? Yeah, because prison, phone sex is bad, you know. I'm bossy, you know. When oh, know you, you, you do that. Yeah. If you're not prison, what do you do? Well, you're going to go cheat on me anyway, aren't you? Regardless, phone sex, I know phone sex that I go after you. Oh, OK. No woman now wait for the man to go to prison. Yeah, they do. I think women wait more than men wait. And yeah. women would wait and be loyal. You know how much woman mean? Let me tell you something. My cousin. Boyfriend go to prison. I two picnic she have now. Yeah. And him come out and them they right back together. No man not wait for the man pass pass a year. No, they do. No, now wait for no man. Next thing me they are prison, stand up and wait for her. When she visit me, she come her belly big. <laughs> oh, oh belly no woman now wait for you if you got you. Oh she pregnant. One year maybe, two year possibly, three year she breed. I would wait. I think that's a, a majority, but there is definitely women out there that would wait. You not waiting. Depends on the situation. We're not, we're not talking about your husband. We're talking about, say you're there with one man for three years. Oh yeah, I'd wait. And then he's out, say you're there with a drug dealer for three years. Mm -hmm. And strong on it together, on the live together, him take care of you. Yeah. All of the wonderful things. Yeah. And then him get lock up. How long? Five years. So do two and a half? No. Five years. Yeah, but in England, if you get five oh. years. Your laws, nigga. He doing five. He doing no, five. Yeah, he just got. He got ten, nigga. That's it. Yeah, let's he just got ten. the number then. Nah, yeah, this is what I found out. I was like, yo. Yeah, so you do two and a half. I'd wait. Yo, can't wait. You can wait for two and a half. Yeah, me. Can. I, could, I think I could wait up to about five. After that, I don't think I could do it. After that, I just strictly dickly. It needs something. <laughs> If I'm serious and I'm like, this man is my life, I'm, I'm kind of angry about that. Maybe even niggas football with numbers here. Yeah. Nah, oh, yeah. 30, 50 First, yards. Yeah, Every week, ooh, yeah, man. Carry your food, you know. Send your one-two picture. Sneak in a little illegal phone. Yeah. Yeah, man. Two years after that, daily answer. 
always busy. Then she pregnant. You don't know where she pregnant from, who breed her. When you look, are your friend breed her? Then now the two of them start come look for you together. Me see it happen too much time. So any man them stay out of violence. You know, don't go to prison for nothing because them you have a for fire. Man oh, man. them don't commit no crime. Because if you commit crime bridging, the woman are fuck on you. Don't feel like say she have a weight. No woman not just feel no. Woman have the same. No, you know, more so fuck like how you would get hard, she get wet. And you see your same friend them, at them. You are in the jail cell asleep and he might go and beat it like Michael Jackson every night. <laughs> See that? See that? That was quite funny. I beat it Yo. and stab it down. I call her and she see the ring. And she just look on it so. And she just can't answer no crime. In the belly, just a dig, a dig, a dig. Yo, brother, just Yo, a this nigga. Don't do it, young man. Just wild, do it. Don't. She'll fuck by you. If she not a picnic for you, you're doomed. She not have no attachment, nothing I'll lock you in. I am ready to go fuck her. Your friend. What would you do if I let you sleep with someone? The closest fucking... Sleep with them. <laughs> what do you mean? You would. If you say sleep with them? Yeah. yeah. I do not think so. You would? Yeah, because I remember you know, when I see you, I don't know what I do. But I'm not doing that. Are you just make me do it? I'm actually, yeah, if I asked you to do it, you would. The only way I would have fully believed you is if you watch me do it. Oh, wow. Maybe me that's okay, she get that, like something out of it. Mm -hmm. But other than that, I would have just feel like, yeah, fuck for me. Yeah, fuck somebody. Oh. Okay. Yeah, if you just send me go fuck somebody, yeah, fuck for me. There's no way about it. So you see, me don't know what she do. Because a woman can't hide things, you know. So really and truly, if she don't want me to know me, we never know. So I prefer to deal with a woman where hide it. Because I don't know what I do if I find out. Maybe like you had a really high sex drive, I didn't. Mm -hmm. And I said, oh, do you know what? I can't keep up. But I don't want you to not be satisfied, so you just go and get it elsewhere. Me, I just go do it. You think me, I go like, try to talk it out tight? Me, even why you like, change your mind. Like, the moment change you your mind. Keep it gone. Shoo. Yeah, me, I definitely do it. Me, I do it, but me, I probably tell her, so me, I go do it. But anytime you hear a woman come up with them things, they them done, them halfway through the door already, are, you know? Them fuck fine. She fuck fine already. If she tell her that already, man, them she get away. Don't feel like no woman are just offer that to you. It's a real thing. It can happen. Woman cheat for a man, man cheat for a woman. It can happen, but it doesn't mean it has to happen. Yeah, but we live in a real world. Mm. And in the real world, world is, if I let you, you would happily take that offer. No, me go go on. Like I said, me not happily take it. Me go ask you, you sure? You know, and then me go say no, and then me go go lie and try to do it. <laughs> yeah, man, we have a lie to the woman we love. You never lie, actually. I think that's the worst thing you to can do. To the woman we love? I mean, you lie, you have to tell them woman they love. <laughs> you need to tell them everything about the truth, yeah. As a man, man them. Let me tell you this. See if you have a girl, and you lie, love her, and you want to keep her, sometimes you have to tell her some lie. Don't lie. Because she will really Don't leave lie. you. He's giving you the worst advice. Do not lie, and do not listen to him. <laughs> yes, so I guess. Them man, you know. Yeah. The man that really are left in woman like that. Yeah. Lie. The truth will always, always come to light. What would you do if I proposed to you? I'm going to tell you a pause and make me do it. Okay. I believe I'm <coughs> a woman that would propose to a man. Mm -hmm. I mean, it would be cool and cute. How have you ever seen that before? No. Oh, no. Absolutely not. No woman na emasculate me at all. No woman na emasculate me. Of course not. I believe the wedding is for the wife, but the proposal is for the man. Yeah. So me feel propose in a some like crazy way. Me feel like skydiver come down out of the sky with the ring. Oh. Yeah. Me feel do it. Do it really big. Yeah. So if you, want, you, do, you wouldn't want us to do it because she wouldn't want to take that moment away from you. That's my moment. The proposal is my moment and the marriage, the, the, the wedding ceremony is her moment. So you would say no to me? What me that do? If we're amongst the monk, people, me that like take the ring and like whisper something and say, all right, you want to see We have to switch this up. You know, I make her look like we did a fake it. Yeah. I'm not going to embarrass her. her. No, I'm not going to embarrass her. Why would I tell her? No, I'm not going to embarrass her. That's lovely. Let me just switch it and make it look like a planet. All right, then let's stop joke and take the ring from her. No, let's man, stop joke. Like that. <laughs> yeah. Girl, if you're out there and you propose to man, you're a waste girl. If you are proposed to no man as a woman, you're a waste girl. You're desperate, bad. You're sorry. You're sad. After she proposed to me, might as well she just lift me up and walk off with me. Then. I will put them all a dang up on the floor. So. Yo. Any woman you propose to a man, she have to be at least 6'5". 
There ain't no way. Did you have a nice day today? Yes, I had a wonderful conversation with you. Was it your favorite day ever? Ever? No. No? No. Why? Because you never give me like a visa or something like that. It's up there though, yeah? Yeah, it's up there. Well, thank you for coming anyway. It's been thank lovely. You See, it's, you smile pretty. You don't drink one glass of the liquor. It was really lovely. <coughs> nice, she ain't drink shit. Conversation. He's so lovely. I could listen to his speech all day. There was some point where he was like rambling, rambling. And to be honest, I don't know what he said or what he was talking about. Uh, listening to his voice. I'm not like, I'm enjoying the conversation with her. You know, he's a bit. I ain't hear nothing you were saying to listen to his voice. I don't know what he said or what he was even talking about. So listening to his voice. I'm not like, I'm enjoying the conversation with her. You know, he's a bit of tit for tat. You know, she's nice. Um, I feel like she's genuine. You know, she's very professional. I'm interested to see if she find me attractive or she's just a hack. I do think there was a little bit of grilling. I don't think they needed to right, so who was like the, the one she rated the highest? I should show the scoreboard, but you know, wasn't it some like rap, nigga? Yeah, they go. Uh, uh, I will see Dane again. He's lovely. He's got great energy. Great accent. Lovely smile. Yeah, he's, he's a nice guy. We definitely would have seen Michelle again. Michelle have the vibe, man, you know? I don't know, I'm not going to give myself 10, but I'm going to give myself anywhere from 8 onwards. You know, I know she like the accent and any girl where you make laugh to a certain degree, they might go, you know, they might go respect you. So, I give myself, I feel like she got put me at 8 because she said me not tall. Well, he was late, so we did the point for that. We did the point for that. Um, it was a great conversation, really lovely person. I will give him an 8. Yeah. Damn, so anyway, he, he got a point that uh, what was this gonna be his shit before? Nine. Nigga PK. Nah, who's Ed Matthews? Nigga got a two. <laughs> no <laughs> way. <laughs> what <laughs> no. What the fuck was he saying? That's heavy. Well, I feel like he just gotta watch that. So like, how did he fuck up that? Nah, bad? Yeah. Nigga definitely got watch that. I mean, what the fuck was he talking about? But she fraud that nigga. Ain't no way you go on a date. She give you a two out of a ten. This shit, man. I had to have been like the first nigga too, bro. Cause Myron, PK, and Dale was the most recent. Yeah.